Mike Householder uh, and Ben Sets. Uh, the product that we're showing today is the MPU 6000. It's the world's only six axis motion processor. It combines a three axis gyro and a three axis accelerometer all on the same die. So we take a product like this and we integrate it into handsets and tablets. This is a very nice and thin development platform yeah, from NVIDIA. Amazing. This is the Tegra 2 developer platform. Mm -hmm. So our gyro is on here. So we combine with an accelerometer and a compass and we show the benefits of motion on a 3D panorama. So this is a panorama of a church or a cathedral and through simple motion I can navigate every aspect of the church just through turns. I can look down, I can look up all the way up to the ceiling and then back down. I can rotate and look around the entire church. So as more and more cameras start to have the ability to capture panoramas, this gives you the viewing experience. This gives you the viewing experience to allow anyone to see the picture to really be in the moment. Amazing. And so why are you exhibiting here at Webcom? Uh, because this seems pretty amazing. So um, uh, one of our primary markets is handsets and tablets. Uh, you notice a lot of smartphones and tablets are integrating gyroscopes and accelerometer technology. We're one of the leading providers in that industry, so we're here to market to our partners and our customers. And what, what kind of devices are you currently shipping on the most right now? So right now, our primary product in the market right now is our three-axis gyro, the MQ3000. The product I just showed you is our next generation product, the 6000, which integrates the accelerometer. So you're hoping to be in the, the next generation of Tegra 2 tablets or NVIDIA Tegra tablets? Exactly. So we're launching, we're launching in handsets and tablets today with our previous generation product, the MPU 3000. This will, the MPU 6000, you'll be seeing later this year in production products. Later this year in production products. Excellent. Well, I can't wait to do this with my new tablet or phone later this year.